Packers will move from left to right. For 12 seasons, Donald Driver has been patiently waiting. They got the ball at their own 44 in the victory formation. For 12 seasons, a Packer undeterred in his quest for a Super Bowl. That moment, so many things are going through your head. The dream that you always dream of is only seconds away before you can celebrate. Rodgers gets the snap. He falls to a knee. 34, 33, 32. When the clock was ticking, that was going through my mind that I am finally here. Green Bay is going to the Super Bowl. Selected in the seventh round of the 1999 NFL Draft, Driver began his Packer career as an unknown out of Alcorn State. The Packers gave me that opportunity and drafted me with the last pick that we had that year. Though he managed just three catches his rookie year, one of them was an eight-yard TD strike from the great Brett Favre. Driver on the wing right side, far back to throw, pops it over the middle, he's got Driver at the five to the end zone, touchdown! Driver would add only one touchdown in each of his next two seasons before becoming Favre's go-to receiver in 2002 when he led the Packers in receiving yards and touchdowns. Far deep down the middle for Driver! Whoa! Dello Driver! Touchdown! For years, Driver was the model of consistency, eclipsing the 1,000-yard receiving mark in six straight seasons. But his team's inconsistency in the playoffs overshadowed all individual accomplishments. It's hard just getting into postseason and you end up losing the first or second round. It seemed like, you know, it's a waste of the season. And that's how my career has been going. Prior to this season, Driver and the Packers had appeared in nine playoff games, winning only three. In all those playoff appearances, you think you have the shot to get to the, the big dance. The Atlanta Falcons just dominated the Green Bay Packers here tonight. Unfortunately, everything doesn't go your way. A disappointing afternoon in the wild card playoffs at Lambeau Field in Green Bay. It's not destined for you to win it that year, but one day, you know, it will be. That success seemed destined in 2007 as Green Bay met the Giants in the NFC Championship. Far fires downfield, wide open, driver at the 30, trying to outrun the defense. Driver's going to score! Touchdown, Packers! Toughest moment is probably 07, knowing that I was only seconds away. The pass intercepted by the Giants at the 40-yard line. This unexpectedly blessed season is over for the Packers. You lose it on one play, those dreams was cut short. You never know when you get back. Three years later, as the 2010 season wound down, another Packer playoff berth seemed unlikely to everyone but Green Bay. When they told us that we had to win the last two games to get in, nobody doubted. And the Packers are going to the playoffs! When you let some team slip in that's dangerous, you see what happens. The Packers not only slipped in, but slipped past the Philadelphia Eagles before dismantling the Atlanta Falcons. The Green Bay Packers are going to the NFC Championship game. That Sunday was probably the best moment of my career. Intercepted! Green Bay all the way to Super Bowl 45! Because of this is what my whole career was made for, holding that trophy in my hand, knowing that I was going to the Super Bowl. The picture that I love is when Reggie White runs in the end zone and holds the trophy up in the air to all the fans. I would love to do exactly what Reggie did and hold that trophy up and let the fans know that the trophy that started here, we bring it right back home.